and welcome back folks to Let's Play Super Mario 64. Now, I'd, be, I'd like a request from another uh, Let's Player for this, but uh, I don't know if any of you like know the Rocky. Well, I know some, quite a few of you will know the Rocky series, but some of you might not. Rocky series is basically like it's like an anthology of films about a fighter called Rocky Balboa. Now, there's a, some of the speeches in it are motivational to for like when he gets when he gets knocked down, but there's one of the bits in the fifth film, which as always, well, it's the first one, basically the first line I've ever cried at when I was a kid. But uh, I was like typing it up on chat on on the Nicholas stream yes last night, and Lola kept on saying, "Oh, do an impression on your next part, do an impression on your next part." So that's what I'm gonna do. So he goes, "Don't lie down like this. Fight Bowser hard. He's no machine." I didn't hear no bell. Get up, you son of a plumber, because Peachy loves ya. Now, I know that probably sounded really rubbish for an impression of Mickey, but I got a request. Uh, I complied. Right, let's go back. Now, we have about two stars we can get in this. Or three, actually. One of them, the last one I'll be getting, is so very, very annoying, folks. Very annoying. Now I've been practicing on this on my own, so I like not be doing it as blind because I really don't like doing things blind because it takes up time. It annoys you a lot because some of you will be going, "Why go that way? You're not doing it right. You can do it easier." It's much easier, really. Also, um, uh, I said like in the video I uploaded earlier on today that. Uh, if I could get figure out how to do it, I'd be like maybe start look playing Luigi Mansion 2. Now I'm not going to. The reason for that is uh, after thinking about it and after thinking of my moral thoughts, I think like in the commu real community of le proper let's players like Necro, you kind of have a general rule where when a game like comes out, you give it like a few a while. You know, so people can actually play it properly on their own. And you give it, I think, I said, I think like two months. So I'm not going to do it, I don't think. But let's get this. Now these, the same as last time, they're electrifying chests. But if you touch the wrong one, you get electrocuted. But this time, if you open them, you don't get your only health back. But I know how to do that one. Another thing I want to mention, I'm actually using a different recorder and it's the best thing I've seen so far. I've been tinkering around with it pretty much half a day. But uh, Shelbix uh, suggested I use it and I swear to God, folks, oh, sorry, excuse me there, but if anyone's a ladies, but I seriously, the quality of the recording is so damn good. The sound, there's no, the sound is brilliant, the sound quality is synced up, there's no lag, emulator synced up to it properly. It's absolutely amazing. Couldn't have, want, couldn't have asked for a better way. I don't know where I'm going here. It really is great. So thank you for that, Charlotte. I appreciate that. Now, with the one after this star on this one, I took a very, very, very long time to try and get. And it is very, very annoying to get. I don't know if I'm going to take as much long here. I hope I'm not. The red coins isn't that hard if you know where they all are. When you get into some of them, it's quite not can be annoying. Yes. Mm, that would have hurt. Last time, when we were trying to do this for me on, I kept falling down nearly like I just did then. And I'm avoiding that this time, not having that hit me. Now 
Now the next start, I don't, I, can, I don't know if you can see that. Well, you can now. This platform, folks, you have to get from a cannon that's quite far away, and you have like an inch to get on. Now, I wonder if you. No, you can't do, do I don't know. Now, when I was a kid, I hated doing that, and I don't, I can't remember if I actually got it eventually, but. After having a playthrough and after doing it the way I used to do it and failing so many times, I actually found a new, easier way of getting that star. And sparing me the annoyance, the high blood pressure from anger and everything, really. Now, one thing I won't remember to do this time, because then I don't have to keep going to him and that will make it quicker. So I'll go talk to the bomb buddy here and open the cannon for the next time. Thanks, buddy. I don't actually need it like, at the moment, but thank you anyway. Your kindness is appreciated. Oh, you. Ugh. Again? Fudging pile got me. Come on, open up. Oh, no, we can't use that yet. That's the one thing I will be doing when we can get to that bit though. I will be using that shell. Good. No, I think the last one's down here. And there it is in that clamp. Avoid the annoying Neil that kept Neil killed me last time. Oh, it would be all the way back up there, wouldn't it? I think last time I actually got the lot ones in the ship last though. But hey, what the hell? Now I know it seems like I'm going the wrong way here but there is a much easier way of getting to the ship which the only reason I used the other way earlier is because I needed to get the red coin like that plus I wanted the other coins. Now just a footnote, this level to get the 100 coins is going to be an absolute pain folks. It really is going to be a pain. I've got him too high so I don't want to go real straight up the ship. Oh, that will look eh? Right, I'll just get this last star because it may take me a while folks and then I'm going to cut off I think One of the most annoying ones for me and the ones I hate. You'll probably find folks that some of the, most of the ones I actually hate are, not, are usually like cannon ones. Maybe very include cannons or trying to get the eight eight red coins in the on the caps courses. Now the easy way I found, which we're mentioning, is actually the better way to do it instead of having to struggle to get it pinpoint accuracy when I don't do that. The best way I found of doing it is if you actually aim for the pinnacle here. I don't know if you call it a pinnacle or stag light, stag light or whatever. But if you aim for the top of that and grab hold of it, if you turn around, you can actually jump from that straight onto a platform, and it's a lot easier. Just amount of aiming properly because if you over, if you aim too high you don't get grab it properly. If you aim too low, right, there we go, like that, and there we go. Much easier.
And with that folks, I think that's all we can get for that one. I'll just have a quick check. I'm going to have to exit course of rice, but I'm just going to have a quick check. But yeah, that's all I can get. I'll have to just select this one. But... Hmm... Should I do the next one? No, I think I'll leave it for no time. Right folks, I'm going to cut off here, so... I've been Gun Games, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.